it's hard starting a conversation with someone you don't know very well. So what I always say is, ask about that person. People love to talk about themselves. Well, a viewer wrote in saying, what do you do if you are talking to someone and they don't like to talk about themselves? I've never met anyone like that, honestly, but I'm sure they exist. I'm sure you're right, and that's a good point. So why don't you talk about someone else, someone that you both know? I mean, nicely, of course, no gossip. But talk about the person maybe that introduced you. You've got to know someone else besides just the two of you. There's got to be some kind of a group, someone that you both know casually at work, at school, whatever, and talk about that person. Oh, she saw this movie, and the movie is great, and blah, 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 and go on and on about the movie, or have you seen the movie? You can do that about books, music, um, sporting events coming up, sports they like to play, hobbies. I mean, you could go on and on. And I know some people are really quiet and they give you yes, no answers. Then you start talking. And I know the worst thing is someone who goes on and on and on and won't shut up. Okay, that's not you. So talk a little bit about something about your family. The holidays are coming up. Talk about crazy Aunt Betty or your nutty grandmother, whatever. And that will draw some laughs. Everyone's got someone crazy in their family. And then they will start maybe talking about their family and kind of chime in. Even if they don't, then talk a little bit more. But don't go on and on. Just talk a little bit, pause, and see if they maybe chime in. And don't be afraid of politics. I know it's a hot-button issue right now. And unless you think that someone's going to get really, really hurt, don't do it. But why not? It'll begin a lively conversation. Talk about trips. Even if you have no money and you can't afford a trip, say, oh, I'd love to go wherever. I saw this place on the news or on the travel channel or wherever. Oh, I'd love to go there someday. And then talk about that place and what you've learned about that place. And then that person could talk about where they would like to go. Your goals, and that would just trigger talking about goals and aspirations and what you want to do in your life. You get the idea. So even if someone doesn't like to talk about themselves, you may be able to draw a little bit more out about them. Because you know how effortless it is to talk to somebody who you really know well? Because you know so much about that person. It's really easy. And that's why it's so hard with someone you don't know. But the quicker you get to know them and find out about them, the faster the conversations will develop. Good luck.